Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to Zanki Zero Last Beginning. Let's carry on where we left off. Look at me, I'm reading the survival guide and look, I can see equipment for adults and how some weapons and armor are too difficult to handle with a child's body and will be reduced to 25% of the original value. I promise, I have grasped the concept now. Unfortunately, there's only four of us left after we got mauled by that wild boar. So I think I'm going to need to grind some more score points. So I'm going to take that advice on board, or and we're going to head downstairs and basically grind a little bit of score so I can actually revive all my team members, among other things, and just got know, it. get used Does to the controls. I've also learned about uh, the ability to auto-equip using tab. So... I might take advantage of that because that will at least take into consideration the um, restrictions on child equipment. So let's form our party with the four remaining survivors and get down there. Everything is going dark. Oh no, we've just lost Rinko, she's too old. That's okay. We're down to three. Which is going to make farming a little bit harder. Maybe we're just going to have to return a base. Alright, I know. We'll switch the umbrella to Mamoru. Uh-oh. Yeah. Huh? Seriously? You want to start hey, this now? What a cheeky little lizard oh, prick. Great. <laughs> just we're in trouble now. Spits on my face and then runs off. What is it? Okay, you take the raincoat. Because there's acid rain around here. Huh? No more messing Ready? around! Ready? Full power? this! Distant me. Okay, well, we're down <laughs> to two. Poison. Some things such as enemy attacks can inflict the poison status. While poisoned, that character's life will decrease over time. The poison status can be cured with items like antidote. Please refer to the survival guide for more on poison's effects and how to avoid it. Alright, well, Minamo oh. got killed by getting slashed by this monkey. Ha! Let's Careful. find an alternate way back home. Whoa. Okay, actually, you know what? This kind of works out. So, Mamoru is now an adult. Everyone else is going to be a kid. We can work with that, right? Right, let's start reviving everyone one by one. Died as an adult, died as a senior. Died from enemy attack, death by ranged attack, death by acid. Died after overcoming trauma. Which is, I guess, um, overcoming the first ruins. Killed by twin-headed lizard. Melted by stomach acid. Right, everyone's back alive. I've spent a bunch of score, which means we need to get farming. So farmers in. You're gonna have to lead the way. Mamoru, you look exhausted, buddy. Okay, sorry if I'm editing out a lot of the combat. I figured, you know what? It can be a bit tedious to watch, maybe, so I'll only basically leave it in if something crazy happens, like that damn boar just attacking me out of nowhere. Let's have a look, shall we? F3, hidden switch in small letters. Right, Whoa! the path to the third floor. We Here. need to solve a riddle, I'm guessing. So let's do that. Yes! <laughs> yeah. Oh dear. Oh, we're already being Whoa. ambushed. Huh? All right, we're back in the treehouse. Let's keep a lookout for those damn boars. Make sure we don't get ambushed like last time. So we need to recover all our weapons. They're all out and about somewhere. Probably where that boar knocked into us, I think, where we lost two people. Looks Probably be a good start. B equals two, dazed equals five. There's some sort of code. Looks like it got added to our survival guide, so let's just quickly have a look. Is it under ruins guide? Okay, so we had that from the last one, and we've got mysterious symbol and locked door. We found some sort of secret code at Treehouse. Lodging. It might be important later, so I'll be sure to remember it. B equals 2, dazed equals 5, B plus dazzled equals B dazzled. Okay. We've found that one already so far. Let's keep looking. This place is like a freaking labyrinth. Okay, what's in here? What's this? Be dazzled equals nine. Circle button on a PlayStation equals zero. Huh? So they mean the same thing. Wonder what this is. Ethanol disinfectant. Okay, cool. Hang on. Let me just double check the other room now. Right, so there's yeah. one more in what's here. What's this? Bandages. Good to see. 
Need to check each room thoroughly, don't I? Make sure all the squares are filled in. It's huh? probably my best bet. Okay, around here. Yeah. Goodness me. Do I like ambush him? No more messing around. Careful. Yes! Oops. I primed it. Yeah! But he's in my square. Whoa. Jeez. <laughs> I thought he only charges like two tiles or something. But he kept going. Do I need to be careful of my lanes? Full power. No more messing around. Uh -oh. Ready? That was costing me stamina, man. Okay. Yeah. I can't go that was there. some good damage. Whoa. Oh wow, almost got sandwiched by the monkey. Whoa. Whoa. Ah. I can't go there. Back, Whoa. back, back. Uh, I can't go oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. I really need to get my Continue. bearings make sure I stop got backing it. into dead ends and stuff. Okay, we're alive. We're alive. We're okay. Whoa! Joy! Okay, we fed the team. Now where's that boar gone? Should probably find a weapon for Rinko though. Before we keep going. Okay, I dropped a bunch of stuff here. We'll pick it up later. Actually, you know what? Some of it's like protection. This door is locked. It's closed. Won't budge. I can't go there. There's something here. Got that one. Oh. Okay, there's our weapons, and that's also where we died. <laughs> Ready? Full power. No more messing around. Yes! Get him. And then back off. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, yeah, he can charge. Huh? He can charge all the way. Uh, I can't go there. Whoa. <sighs> all right, yeah, huh? back off. I'm going to go collect my stuff. We might need this. I'll hold this. We might need this. Pick up anything that looks like armor. <laughs> okay. Let's just hide in here. Close the door. Right. Quipping time. I swear there's two of them. Oh, there is. Ah, Whoa. Okay, don't want to get sandwiched. <sighs> Somehow Rinko can wield that hatchet no problem compared to the rusty saw. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. God, I feel like a matador right now. Ready? Full Get him! This. Yeah. Yeah. That thing's tough, man. Okay, so I can't hear anything once I close the door. Full power! No more messing around! Ah. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, we killed it! Lucky me! Huh. It bleeds after all. I'll take it. I'll okay. get it. Let's I pick can't up all our stuff. All of this. And quickly pass it on to someone else. <laughs> nice. I'll hold that. I gotta say, ever since we've optimized our weapons, this is a whole lot easier. <laughs> so thank you for hounding Whoa. me until I got it right. What okay. could this be? There's a guidebook for the treehouse and a visitor's book to sign. There's something here. Okay, and we got something over here. What could this be? Times is multiplication. Multiplication. A math problem. There's something here. It says interacting with other guests in the lounge is highly encouraged. So I'm guessing the ones that were had like a star on it is something to do with our current objective and everything else is just flavor text, which is fine. Campground notes. We're here at the camping school, grade five, class three. We're here with our family. Mom's cooking curry for dinner. Masato. I'm here with my girlfriend, Tomohisa and Minami. I'm camping with the boys. Let's get wasted. Hiro and Masa and Katsun and Fukushin. Beautiful star, W and K. Hmm, I wonder if there's anyone we will learn more about. Okay, we've got this now. Be dazzled equals nine. Circle button equals zero. B equals two. Days equals five. B plus dazzled equals be dazzled. Star is multiplication. If B, days, be dazzled, and circle are numbers. Okay, leveled up a little bit. You can see Mamoru's pretty stressed out because he didn't get to use the toilet. 
He only had a bottle. It was all I could do for him, okay? Anyway, I leveled up Sachika's cooking level, so hopefully we can cook some better food then to recover our stamina. Let's have a look. Nope, I can't, can't cook the monkey meat, which is fine, I guess. We'll figure out a way to survive. I did pick up some vegetables, so that's all right. I gotta say, this game is pretty, it's pretty hard to get used to, but I think now I'm starting to get a feel for it all. It's just when these boars appear, it makes me kind of nervous. Let's watch the TV. Keep an eye on that boar as well. Someone's gonna have to keep watch. Hey, kids! It's time for Extend TV! Alrighty. Let's watch the next PodQuest video. It's Wrap Part 3 Funeral. Oh, so we're cutting straight to the aftermath, are we? It's showtime! Okay. Even the mascots weren't dicking around that time. Grandma died. Well, the person I wasn't related to who I called Grandma died. <laughs> Jeez. Thank you, all of you, for coming to my mother's funeral today. My mother hadn't been feeling well since last summer, and the person I thought was my dad is acting as the chief mourner for the person I thought was my grandma. Something wrong, Zen? You don't look too hot. Actually, you know what? You are my nephew. <laughs> Who is he again? The person I called my big brother. But he isn't. Zen, there's still time until the cremation. You can go rest if you aren't feeling well. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty sick. This past year, I'm sure she was happy getting to live with our son and his family. <laughs> oh gosh. But a double meaning hidden in that sentence, Mr. Grandfather. I'm so thankful you all decided to come to this house. This is making me sick. Zen, what's wrong? Mom, Zen just puked. What? Are you okay? Do you have a fever? <laughs> How shameful. Zen, as a man of Kubota, you must be strong at times like this. This is all so fake. Just monkeys playing at being a family. Oh dear. Poor Zen. He was just a little kid. It must have been hard on him. It would be hard on anyone, really, but double-fold because he's a kid. Why couldn't everyone be more considerate of him? I'm full of laughs right now. Yeah. <laughs> I think you mean wrath, not laughs. Yeah. Oops. That's Zen, not me. He's not full of laughs either. Zen was obviously disgusted. Their sleaziness made my wool curl. By the way... Why do we call these videos conquest videos? Is it because we need to conquer our sin? Basically, redeem ourselves? Well, that was a sloppy segue. <laughs> but I may as well take this chance to explain. Please do. You conquer ruins by obtaining machine parts inside them, but... Hey, hey. To do that, you need to defeat the boss first. I see. So you could say conquering ruins is equivalent to conquering the boss. And the boss... I guess is always related to our past. Say, say. And you can get a sneak peek of the boss in these conquest videos. Or so I'm told. I see. Okay. So a bit of a foreshadowing. Basically, you'll know who the bosses are before fighting them. Pretty important info, right? But how did you guys get this intel on us? Beyonce. What are you even what? saying? Only the last part made even a lick of sense. Illuminate. A brighter future. For, For Beyonce. Beyonce. Nice, I tried to I tried to save it. Bye bye! <laughs> bye. Okay, so it looks like Zen's grandfather is going to be our boss. Looks like Wrath was delayed a little bit. Maybe he didn't uh, inflict it upon his grandfather at the time, but maybe we're gonna do it now. Okay. <laughs> I don't know whether it's better to charge our attacks or just slash and hack at them. I do remember you guys telling me something. Yeah. <laughs> but for now. I'm just gonna stick to normal slashes. It conserves my stamina. Yeah. And I don't have to time things. Yeah. Okay. See, now this is more like it. A lot more room to maneuver, which Lucky gives me more me. of a chance to take down the enemy. Okay, so there's the door that we're that's that's locked. I'll take it. Until I solve the puzzle. Look suspicious. Not circle, be dazzled. Okay. We'll get to that in a minute. Let me just make sure I've explored everywhere I can, taking down all the enemies I can. And then we'll come back here, because I could use the score. 
after uh, spending a lot of it to revive everybody. Careful. Oh, we got another door. Oh, lizards. Well, nice try. Got the star there. No more messing around. Careful. Ready. Oh. It's okay, Minamo. You're okay. You're okay. Okay, quite a few things in here. It seems. Let's have a look, shall we? B times not times dazed equals not circle. Hmm. What could this be? Found flower. Let's have a look, shall we? Found more flower. Found a third what flower. What could this be? Okay, so it's worth like double checking things. I think I figured that out in the uh, Monsieur Garden Tower. There's something here. It says today's menu is Western style cuisine using many fresh eggs. Hmm. What could this be? It says, please enjoy our delicious buffet-style meals. Man, there's all sorts of rooms in this treehouse. Okay, looks like I've explored everything there is, except for maybe over here, so let's double-check that. Oh, of course, it's the same. something here. <laughs> it says, if injured, please see a me staff member for medical assistance. Bunch of stuff here I'm going to need to remember to grab before we head on to the next area. Uh, now I have to feed these kids. Come on, Mamaru. Let's look after the daycare. I'd like to... Uh, I don't even Whoopsies. worry about it. <laughs> Gee, she just like ate the thing. And now she needs to go to the damn bathroom. Well, she did. And then she just crapped herself in the pants. Stench. Some things such as when a character's bladder gauge fills all the way can inflict the stench status. Some other characters will be easier for enemies to spot. In addition, they will increase stress for other characters in the party. Stench can be cured with items like soap. Please refer to the survival guide for more on stench's effects and how to avoid it. Maybe go to the bathroom before... Uh, feeding them. So let's maybe bench Rinko for now. All right, I think it's time to solve these puzzles. What so what do we this got? Be? Not circle this way. Be dazzled. Okay, so we've got be dazzled, which is fine, but we don't have not. We're gonna need to um, use our algebraic skills to do this. Goodness me, it's been a while. Okay, so if be dazzled. Be dazed, dazzled. <laughs> if be dazed, be dazzled, and circle our numbers, we have to combine the switches with numbers on them and find the correct answer. For example, turning on the switches for two and seven will be two plus seven equals nine. Okay, so two times something times five equals something that ending with zero. So I'm going to guess that not is 1, because 2 times 1 times 5 is 10, and that could be not. So let's try that. There. Ah, oh, okay. Turn the... F so if I turn on the switches that is I want, it? then it should open the door. I'm going to activate it. It seems I can't just force it open. Sorry, got to answer. What could this be? Nothing seems to happen. Okay. I'm going to activate it. There. What could this be? Okay, two, three, and five opens it, but not seven and three. Good to know. Looks like we just unleashed some more lizards. Let's take him down. <laughs> Get back here, you little shit. Honestly, going after these lizards sometimes. Huh? It's a lot of hard work. No. What the heck? It reached me from there? <laughs> Finally, maybe goodness this me. Will come in handy. I swear, sometimes the hitboxes maybe or something just causes me to Let's miss so this. much. <sighs> and just the controls sometimes are just so tanky. It's okay, we'll figure it out. There's a hole in the ceiling. What's this? Good to know. Looks like there's a staircase there. Maybe this will come in handy. Alright. Okay, still kids. Which is okay, I guess. Oh, wow. Whoa. We start with a freaking lizard in our way. What are you doing? Huh? Go away. Anyway, <laughs> new TV. Oh, boy. <laughs> this is... <laughs> I'm so sorry if I'm frustrating hey, you guys or anything. It's time for Extend TV. I'm trying, okay? I'm trying to be better at this game. It's time to watch the next Conquest video. It's... Wrath Part 4, The Raging Forest. It's quite a long season of videos we got it's here. It's showtime. Ow. Oh. 
What are you doing, Zen? There's something I want to ask you. Goodness. He's going after his mother first. Aha! Is my father human? Or is he a monkey? What? S Zen? Oh, don't tell me you know. I'm, I'm sorry! Why are you apologizing? Answer my question! Is my father human? Or is he a monkey? I don't have that sort of relationship with him anymore, so please don't let your father- Who's him? What's that sort of relationship? Which father? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Answer me. Why are you apologizing, Mob? Goodness me, he's gone all out. It's been two years since I saw the monkeys at the treehouse. I'm in middle school now, and I've become physically bigger. Oh, so you were just biding your time until you got some muscles before you expended your rage on your parents. Well, one parent for now, but those dark emotions are still there, brewing inside me. It would have gotten, it would have gotten worse because he would have bottled it up that entire time. I wonder, since when did it become a daily occurrence for me to beat my mom? A daily occurrence? I need some more money to go out. Can you lend me some, mom? I don't have any more for this month. I'm sorry. Sorry, huh? <laughs> Is that all you ever say? Ugh. Zen, you're hitting your mother again. D dear, do you realize what you're doing? How could you kick your mother like that? This is inhumane. Maybe I'm not human myself. I am the son of a monkey, after all. Good, I like how his dad isn't exactly putting a stop to this. I wonder, does he know, perhaps? Please, don't. I don't think he does because she was begging him not to tell him. Zen, what happened to you? If you're discontent with me, just say so. Or can you only be aggressive with someone weaker than you? It's not discontent I'm dealing with. Just... anger. With nowhere to go. Stop this! I could hear you from outside. Don't you dare bring shame to the Kubota house. Hey, you're one to talk, mustache man. I'm surprised you're not just twirling it right now with your damn fingers, watching and smiling at what I've become as your son. Father. Maybe I should just tell them everything. Then I wouldn't have to put up with this charade of a family. I think you should have a long time ago. Does your, uh, quote-unquote, brother deserve to know? We'd all go our separate ways. It'd be the end of this house. Ugh! Zen, wait! Have some respect, fool. Learn to be more like your father. My father has no respect. <laughs> Did you hear that? He just told Zen to be more like his father. And the worst thing is we don't know who he's referring to. Is he still like referring to his so-called dad or his actual dad? I can't believe Zen didn't poke fun at him for making such an obvious joke. If Zen did, that probably would have been a healthier way to deal with it. And I can't believe I'm saying that, considering it would have been civil war in the Kubota residence. But I think that's the better alternative than just beating up your mom and just everyone questioning you and going, why are you beating your mother? Like, what the heck? Show your mother some respect. And he just doesn't tell them why. Hmm. But then again, of course, these are all sins in the past that they've, they've committed. So obviously Zen is in the wrong here. I don't think that was supposed to be a joke. Oh, that's right. His grandpa's usually the one that does the poking. <laughs> oh, God. Quit being naughty, mister. Anyway, I don't like the path he's heading down. I wonder what's going to happen now. If you ask me, anyone who uses violence on their own parent is a real scumbag. I, I would be inclined to agree, but I know there are some circumstances where, like, abusive parents or whatnot, in which case, by all means, defend yourself. E even if... It's the parents' fault. <laughs> Hard disagree on that one. Aw, show. Did it remind you of your family again? Damn it! <laughs> I've got gummy worms running out of my nose again. That's one way to say oh, it. Oh, gummy worms this time? Amalgamate. Some sugar and gelatin together. Bye bye. <laughs> okay, guys. Goodness. <laughs> Right, well, Z while Zen gets his act together in the past, I need to get my shit together in the present. By trying to kill this yeah. damn lizard. Yeah. There we go, we got him. I'll hold that. At least we're s our score is Whoa. building up again, which is nice. Be a nice haul to take back to the Let's have a look. Where is the restroom? 
a local facilities guidebook, there was a camping area by the river. You need the restroom? Shit. Gotta go like every five minutes, it seems. Right, now he's gonna be even more stressed. Rio's gonna need to go soon. Whew, a lot of management I need to take There's care something of. here. Playing cards are spread out on the table. Okay. What could this be? I don't know. I don't know what it means. Okay. Whoa. Oh. Are you alright? Zen, are you okay? Talking about the uh, latest Conquest video? I don't want it. Please, I don't need your sympathy. That was actually quite invigorating. Though it's not motivation it fills me with. It's anger. It's that emotion inside me again. It grows darker with each Conquest video as they dig up my memories. She gazes at me, as if to observe my reaction. Well, we have been hounding her and kind of antagonizing her a little bit, haven't we? Her facial expression is the same as usual, without giving any hint of emotion. What? No. I was just thinking you are surprisingly masochistic. Yeah, yeah. Oh, were you expecting some fain painful looking expressions and reactions like with Haruto? Well, sorry to burst your bubble. You went through all that trouble of modifying our bodies, too. Yes. Not to worry. I do not expect anything from you. Of course, you are free to be suspicious of me if you wish. No, no, no. I'm not suspicious. I'm just waiting. For you to spill the beans, that is. Hey! Zen, I asked you hey. to stop. Let me ask. What do you all think of Madam here? Well... <laughs> Everyone's just talking in their childlike voices. That's... She's a bit eccentric, but I think she's nice. Yuma's not yeah. a bad person. I don't have a reason, but I just know. Yeah, I feel like you just know because you've got more info than all of us combined. That's true. Judging what we know so far, I do understand why you would think Mashiro is suspicious. What? What? Mamoru? However... But those suspicions should be directed at Mashiro Group. Since Miss Yuma is also a clone, it's more than likely she was dragged into this like the rest of us. <laughs> <laughs> Even though she's the President's daughter? If he turned his own daughter into a pawn for some game, he must be a real piece of shit like my dad. I can't keep the dark emotions from leaking out of my mouth. But it's not because I suspect her. There's just something about her. Ever since we met, I haven't liked her for some reason. Hmm. Her eyes, her words, they all serve to annoy me. <laughs> or maybe your father didn't love her at all. Zen! That's enough. Shut up! Oh dear, I think we got under her skin. This is the first time she's displayed any strong emotions. What do you know? Don't you dare insult my father and me when you know nothing of us. Uh, Huma. Uh, hey! Zen, you need to back off. It seems I struck a nerve. But this may be a good chance for me to shake her up a bit. Mm -hmm. Such a strong reaction. Is it because you know something? Like your father pulling the strings behind this hole? <laughs> my father is gone. What? What? She lets out a sigh. Then back to her usual self. She begins speaking matter-of-factly once more. Yes. It was never announced to the public, but my father is dead. Before the world ended. No. Three days before I woke up on Garage Island. Really? So, he passed away three days before you woke up here, so it was obviously very recent. I don't know how to respond to her unexpected reply. She could still be lying. But there's something oddly convincing about her words. I think... I think we can believe her on that front. Yuma. Let's go. Let us move on. Our objective here is getting the machine part. She looks away and begins walking. <gasps> Wait up, Yuma. <clears throat> oh, Sen, go say you're sorry. I don't think sorry is in his vocabulary. You shouldn't make a lady angry like that, Sen. No, no. Can't help it. So I'm the bad guy now. I... Zen, I don't know what sort of emotions you're harboring after being shown those videos. How can you not know? It's obviously anger and hate. But I'm sure they're not anything you want to be reminded of. So I get it. How you feel, I mean. I went through the same thing. What? So please, don't take it out on Yuma. Or anyone else. That won't help us get any closer to the truth. Sheesh. He assumes I'm feeling down or something. He just doesn't seem to get it. He doesn't realize I don't regret or feel sorry for anything I've done. <laughs> Thanks, leader. You're too kind. 
Let's just hope you're not missing the mark with your kindness. <sighs> Zen. I can sort of understand Zen, how he's talking about he doesn't regret what he's done, because all he's seeing is red right now. 156, did someone just get, like, injured or something? Someone take damage? Because harboring all that anger and stuff, it just makes you sort of numb to everything, and you don't feel bad. Is anyone you know, hurt? Boy, I shouldn't have felt like that. What was that all about? I wonder. Anyway. Uh, yeah, you don't feel like, oh, I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have pushed so hard. For him, like, he did what he had Whoa. to do to punish them and just get his revenge. There's something here. Teach them a lesson. Looks like pesticide. I wonder if they used it to maintain the scenery. Okay, okay, I'll feed you, I'll feed you. Where is the restroom? Nothing wrong with some healthy urine. Ah, uh, don't even worry about it. Oh dear, he went before I even had a chance to put the bottle in him. <laughs> God, oh gosh. All right, take that. Thank you, Sachika. We're eating raw food and shit everywhere. Literally, we've got Rinko and Mamaru crapping all over the place. <sighs> Okay, give Sachika the rusty knife. Let's keep going. Another TV so soon. What do we have here? The tea set is ruined with some sort of mold that was growing all over it. Okay. TV. There's a bed. I don't suppose we could sleep on it. Okay. What's next? Hey, kids! It's time for Extend TV! Alrighty, part five. We've come so far. Make sure to keep the trip back in mind, too. It is in the back of my mind, among all other things. I'm juggling so much, it seems, and it's it's too much for me right now. I need to keep getting used to it. Let's bring out the next Conquest video. Wrath part five. Welcome the newlyweds. The newlyweds? Don't tell me that happened. Anyway, Wrath part five. We're not even at the final it's part yet. It's showtime! Zen, you still hanging out with those bad kids? Mind your own business. I'm your brother. This is my business. I also heard you've been hitting mom and pestering her for money. <laughs> Jeez. It's all right. We don't need to bring that up. It's not all right. This is all my fault. I've been so busy since I went to college, I didn't notice the changes in you and Zen. That should have been my job. It's my fault for failing as a father. Your role was to graduate college and go out into society. And you've done just that. You even found a wonderful wife along the way. I'm so proud of you. <laughs> what a joy. She's moving in tomorrow, is that right? Yeah, we're planning to get married next month. But she wants to get used to this place as soon as possible. I'm scared about his grandfather trying to pull some sick stunt again. I see. I can't wait. Bitch, you caught, you dirty old man. Yeah, Zen can't fathom it. I hope to prove myself worthy of joining the Kubota family. Thank you again for having me. Welcome, Rumiko. But there is no need to be so tense. Even the neighbors told me there aren't many women who are willing to move in so quickly these days. Make yourself at home. There's no need for modesty. I, I, I seek and guess everything this grandfather says. Where have I heard that before? Yeah. Um, nice to meet you. You're the younger brother, Zen, right? I'm an only child, so I always wondered what it would be like to have a brother. So, you know, I'd be really happy if you could think of me as your older sister, too. Rumiko, was it? I can't and won't be your brother. Zen! Sorry, Rumiko. He used to be a good kid, but I just don't know what he's thinking these days. That's the problem. It's okay. We've only just met. Still, it's kind of rude. She seems... Awfully nice. Zen, I hope I'm not too much of a bother, but I'll do my best to fit in here. So I hope we can get along. Ever since those two moved in, it's been even harder for me to stay at home. Maybe I'll stay at my buddy's place tonight. There you are, Zen. Like, I'm surprised Zen still stays here, you know? Why doesn't he just move on, move out? It's obviously just making him sick, but then and poisoning his mind, but maybe that's what he's using. He's just letting it build up all this rage inside him. And it's kind of sad and depressing to see it tear him apart like that from the inside. Oh, you. Hmm? Didn't expect you to be a smoker. 
You really shouldn't be doing that, you know? It's not good for you. What are you doing here? If you want to lecture me, you're wasting your time. I feel she's kind of imposing here, like they've just met. She wants to be, she wants him to be her brother, so to speak. And he's obviously a bit cold towards her. And now here she is antagonizing about a smoking. It's just not going to go well, you know? No lectures. I just want to ask you something. That's so. Well, I don't want to answer. Why won't you call me Big Sis? Are you even listening to me? Hmm? Why won't you? What's with her? She's hard to deal with. Fine, if she wants to play, I'll mess with her a little. You're not my sister. Because you're not even my sister-in-law. My brother doesn't know this, but he's actually more like my nephew. That makes you my nephew's wife. Everyone's just keeping this a secret and pretending to be one big happy family. <laughs> just kidding. Guess it wasn't that funny a joke, huh? Get it now? I have no intention of having a serious conversation with you. That wasn't a lie, was it? Uh-oh, you've been found out! Huh? Look, I, I told you. But Zen, you look like you're about to cry. Okay. I've decided. Nephew, uncle, doesn't matter. I'm going to be your big sister. Oh, sorry, she said that. I'm going to be your big sister. <laughs> What's that? She really is a strange one. Hmm. Interesting. Wow. Zen got himself a new sister-in-law. Yeah. And it seems like she's on his side, which is great. It's... It's very suspicious, is what it is. An older sister-in-law, huh? I envy him. I wish I had one. Sister-in-laws are meant to be sister-in-laws. <laughs> you already have someone like a big sister, remember? Not wives or partners. I do? Who? Yeah, you know, she's pretty cute, reliable, a little clumsy at times, and an herbivore girl who looks good in white wool. See, the thing is, you're a sheep. <laughs> oh, you mean beyond? Remember, kids. <laughs> of course, he's going to get a spanking later Illuminate. on. Illuminate. A brighter future. For humanity! Bye-bye! Piece by piece, slowly but surely, Zen is starting to come to get... I'm gonna try using it. Whoops. <laughs> well, Haruto died. <laughs> Got it. Oh, I'm such a sucker. Take it. Pulling things oh. I have no business pulling. Oh gosh. I need to make sure I fight these boys in the corners. Watch out. It's the only way I can take care of them. Running out of room. Yeah. <laughs> ah, okay. Oh. Yeah. We're gonna need to return to base soon. Can't hold it in much longer. Sorry, Rio. I'm busy right now. Yeah. Oh, God. Okay, it's dead. Does this look useful? Right, come on, let's keep going. I gotta find like a save room or something. I'll leave this all there for now. We'll pick hey, it up later. What's this? I found a note. I'll read it later. Yep, I agreed huh? with that. Read it later. Another TV? Oh jeez. I think now's probably a good time to just return Careful. to base and revive everyone before things get really crazy. Let's huh? head back. And we're back. Goodness me. Again, guys, I call upon you to help me and give me more tips. <laughs>